Now I can add the V-Ray dome light. And this is where we're going to add our HDRI. I'm just going to shift it over to the right so it's out of the way. I'm going to open up the material editor, drop a V-Ray bitmap, navigate to our HDRI. Now remember from the previous video, we have to switch this from standard to spherical because it's a dome. So that'll make it display properly. And then we'll drop the HDRI into the map for the dome light. I'm going to check lock texture to icon. So if we enable the V-Ray IPR and we rotate the dome light, checking lock texture to icon will rotate the HDRI with our icon. Now, one thing I'm noticing here is that our HDRI is backwards and you can tell that by the parking spot number there. So I'm just going to have to go into the material and flip the HDRI horizontally. And now it's lining up better to the shot that we have.